anyone who forces me to do anything in the future, refer to this video or I will show you this specific video. I'm tired of going to restaurants with people who eat differently than I do. We all deserve to be a part of a community that resonates with us. It's not disrespectful to say I don't want to be around people at a dinner or a country club with hundreds of people who are all eating differently than I than how I like to. Now eating is one thing, partaking in other activities is another. A, a, a lifestyle. Nobody should ever be forced to go through with customs and traditions that do not resonate with who they are. This entire country club is all the same people doing the same things. And this system was based upon racism because there's not one single darker skin, a very, very, very darker skinned individual here. And it's ridiculous. You see the separation. There should be multi all different types of people uniting. And there's one thing called, there's open racism and there's silent racism. I believe the silent is worse because all these people who think they're entitled, you know, these, these are just mindsets and, and ideologies. And it's even you, this country in general to think that they're privileged and they have all these luxuries while others do not have it. You'll have that taken away from you because this is, uh, this is closing down all of your luxuries and things that you can enjoy while the ecosystem's being shut down. You think you're so privileged because you have material possessions, all of these cars, and you have some money. You have a country club that you can go to. Meanwhile, there's real stuff going on. People who don't even have access to this stuff. And not only that, this stuff's getting closed down. There's not gonna be any gasoline remaining. You're not gonna be able to have the, these luxuries. And I'm completely done with this indoctrination. I've gone through so much just just by showing up for traditions and not and being shut down. And whenever I'm trying to say something, nobody wants to listen to me. I know a lot and people do not listen. And it is disrespect. The silent racism really bothers me because these infra this infrastructure is set up and it, it divides the, the 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 yoga place that I go to there's it's all the same skin tones like all different skin tones cannot you know it, it, it's it's not meant to be separate like that it really fucking it's fucking terrible. We need you you deserve control, you deserve power over your own life. Nobody should dictate that. When you have integrity, when you know what you're doing, you create something. My goal is to create something. People are silent racists. And I, I, I can't and no one will speak out against it. I just walked into a country club. Not one single darker skin. It's all like separate. It's all separate. You see what I'm saying? And they just laugh. They, they'll be like, hey, I'll eat this. I don't eat meat. Everyone's eating meat in there. And it's just the same thing. I like to be under the sun. I like to connect with the trees. And all different people could be doing that. And then you, uh, yes. And then there are those who are very dark skinned who think that they're the ones who are privileged and they're the ones who deserve everything. And they're more superior. But no, the fact is anybody can tap into this energy. Anybody can, can connect with the trees and the sun and nature and carbon and all of that. Race is an illusion. It's racism that exists. I like to be free. I like to roam around and travel. This is a golf course. But what do people do? People are, are in that country club over there. They're sitting down at one table just eating meat acting like they're in control. They can dictate how I do. They can look down on me. Hundreds of people. Well, you know, I'm just sitting there. You think I'm just going to accept it? It's entitled privilege bullshit.
and my goal, and it's not even a goal, it's a reality, is to just uh, be free. Because they've made it cold for the longest. These winters and falls in the Chicago area are freezing. And it's not good. <laughs> that's how they're allowed, that's how they're able to control. It's by through weather control to make it, the atmosphere cold, to, to beam frequent frequencies into the ionosphere through HARP and all these other stations. And you think that I'm just going to sit in that fucking country club and not talk about it, just stuff my face with meat, all this processed shit, drinking alcohol and all this fucking bullshit. Meanwhile, I should be free, exploring around here. I'm so fucking done with all of this. It's uh, this, this stuff has been closing down, and each moment that passes gets a little bit closer to a complete shutdown. These structures, all these these roads, these buildings, uh, using the gas companies, just going through with a normal system. This stuff is coming to a close don't see it. They want to be entitled. It's their ideologies. They're so fucking privileged. Because they have some money. They they have it they went to a prestigious college. Didn't learn shit about anything. They got money. They got possessions. They live in a bigger house, a bigger apartment. They have things they can show off. They can they have statuses they can show off. They can say, I know this person. They can look down on people like me who 